Could you tell us what the index showed for the month of September? Um, yep, yeah, September was, was a good month. Um, the index grew 15% year on year, so um, strong, solid double digit growth. Uh, slightly down on what we'd seen earlier in the year uh, when the index uh, grew 18% between January and uh, June. Mm -hmm. uh, so we have seen a slight slowdown, uh, but when you compare it to the high street where sales were up just 0.3% year on year in September, mm -hmm. um, overall a good, good solid month for the e-retail industry. Could you tell us what the index showed us for this quarter? Uh, this quarter, um, the index grew 13.5% year on year, mm. uh, slightly down on what we'd seen in the first half of the year, which was around 18% growth. Um, we have seen a, a, a slight slowdown in the third quarter, and mm. what we're also seeing as well is that um, sectors that are selling higher ticket items, such as electricals and travel, mm. are faring less well than lower ticket item sectors, such as clothing, lingerie, accessories. Um, clear indication really that consumer behaviour is changing mm. um, and that people are spending more um, on lower ticket items rather than you know um, travel and higher ticket electrical items. Yeah. Um, one exception to this though is the home and garden sector uh, where we've actually seen sales grow 40% year on year over the last um, two months. Wow. Um, so again another indication that people are not perhaps spending as much on travel, travelling mm. on holidays but are staying at home and spending, spending on their homes. I've noticed that you've revised the forecast uh, for this year, could you explain to us a little bit why, about why you've done that? Yeah, um, at the beginning of the year we forecast um, overall growth in the e-retail industry of 18% year on year um, and in the first six months of the year that was that was bang on target the index did grow 18% uh, following the slowdown to 13.5% in the third quarter we've revised our forecast downwards for the year to 16% um, mm. with an estimated um, e-retail spend of 68.2 billion pounds um, now, one reason for, for this is that in the fourth quarter of last year, the index showed particularly strong growth, up 23% year on year. Mm. So, when we, you know, on the back of that, we are expecting slightly uh, less growth um, year on year in the Q4.